Joseph LeVay and Giannis Amelins. What an incredible match to start things off here in the lightweights. Unbelievable war in prospect. And that's what we expected. Last year's hammer holder, the reigning champion, is in deep water. And he's in deep water early from a committed and dangerous new addition to the Lal roster. LeVay has massive strength and he's trying to work through the rotation and top roll strength of Amelins. The Jedi known for that intelligence, but right now he's struggling to get a bite in this match and struggling to be able to apply the technique. He's absolutely on the red line and he's been dragged into Joseph's game. This is a dogfight and it may come down to who's got the greater stamina. Now the Jedi starting to get a little bit of application there. Looking for position and LeVay's horribly extended. Surely an elbow, it's being called. We now then, the running here. foul on LeVay. Yeah, Amelins has the option to either drop the match and restart, or alternatively, if he feels he can win, which he clearly does, he can hang on to this and finish. LeVay in trouble. You can see his eyes are bloodshot with the effort. And Yanis Amelins diligently trying to gain hand control, pressing, probing, looking for the gap. Waiting there, he's going to try to climb the thumb and break open the wrist of Lave. If he can do that, that will neutralize the forearm and he can move for the press. There's the win. Yanis Amelin. Wow. What a start. He's complaining that Joseph went to the straight arm position, but the Frenchman stayed within the rules. That is a pivotal moment. The hammer holder from 2015 may have just sold most of his energy early. Yeah, we'll see if it does cost him down the stretch.